There are definitely is not. Victory Road was like, yeah, three floors. <laughs> yeah, she does that. You playing uh, original second gen or Heart Gold Soul Silver? I actually think Huntel is a better use of my. Um, my fusion bolts. Why does rap from Huntel make sense? I mean, it is a giant fucking snake. So it's over. Yeah, and you probably sp paid through the nose for it. Because even though it's Fairly outdated. GameStop still wants fucking 50 bucks for it. Which is bullshit. I mean, it's a good game, but. You know. Outdated. Can't even go online with it anymore. Light screen's not gonna help you when I'm hitting you with physical attacks, or dumbass. Isn't Cardon supposed to have thrash? Eh. I guess I can't bitch about people spending a shit ton of money. I mean on a game because I did just spend sixty dollars on Ocarina of Time 3D. Which I'm really not sure it's even worth that. But then again this is because, you know, I'm in the camp of saying Majora's Mask is the superior of the two. Switch a roof failing. Well, the thing is, they're out of print, so... Yeah, there's that. Scolipede is faster than Jotaro? Huh. I still have my copies of Heart Gold Soul Silver, even though I don't really need them. <laughs> well, as long as I have at least one copy of the 4th uh, Gen games, and at least one copy of the 5th Gen games, I can, I can um, transfer up to 6th Gen. Need I remind you about the fucking Xenoblade Chronicles thing? Nintendo reprinted the game, and GameStop was popping them open. Doing one thing to the disc, saying, oh, it's used now. Yeah. They are some pretty underhanded cunts there at GameStop. Holy shit, why did that get a critical hit? Fuck you, Crawdont. Switch now. Well, 
Wouldn't surprise me. Conquest is trailing. At least everything here is a physical attacker. At least in the sense that it's the physical attack is the primary attack stat. Ooh! Sock! Night days. <sighs> Echoed voice. Nice special set there, uh, Karate Man. Like I was trying to say when I got distracted by the sock. Fucking Richard Review Tech USA said that GameStop's getting back into the retro market. That should pop a price bubble. No, it won't. GameStop was looking at eBay saying, Hey, all these games are going for a shit ton of money. We can turn that into we can turn that into big old mucho grande dollars. That's all GameStop's gonna do. You know, they're going to bring all these fucking expensive games in. They're probably only going to give, like, five bucks. And then they're going to fucking charge twice as much as the eBay prices. That's, if anything, that's going to inflate the price problem. And I really need a good place to grind. Someone brings in their copy of fucking uh, Gold Cart fucking Championship NES, whatever the fuck it was called. Probably only give them like 40 bucks for it and then turn around and try to sell it for 50 grand. I don't know, I kind of feel like Conquest is just falling off right now. <sighs> yeah, good point. And fuck you, Crawdont! bag. got a point there. I was just trying to make a point myself. Damn it, Skullpede, why are you so fast? I don't know. It's like this people at the fucking uh, flea markets and shit. They don't know what they have, so they just hawk it. Though I'm pretty sure all the remaining copies that are still working and all that are actually in the hands of collectors that won't be wanting to part with them anyway. Right, if I can keep the scallopedes up, that'd be great. Eh, Huntails aren't bad. 
Can do without the trace, though. Yeah, Huntails are better use of my fusion bolts. Yeah, if I, if I go to GameStop, I try to buy uh, new whenever possible. Because their used prices suck. And you know, if I and if I've got to go to the great, the greatest of all evil, I might as well, you know, support the people that I'm buying the games thereof. So like, I think I got lucky with my copy of Tabarachi Life because it was 35. But then again, we went to Walmart like 10 minutes later. And I'm like, son of a bitch, I gotta save five bucks. But then again, I was at Walmart in Williston. And Williston, North Dakota has the shittiest Walmart I have ever been to. They have nothing in stock. Though I did get my peach amiibo there, so... And it was like, eight bucks. So I guess I can't bitch too much. Poisonous thing, rock blast, ice ball. Grind City. Yeah, light screen's really helping you there, isn't it? Alright, crawl on. I'm kind of getting annoyed by you. <sighs> Great, Scallopede's gonna be the only thing I can really grind Leviathan on. Use a fire pledge. I guess you could use Sludge Bomb on the, um... On, like, out of the hunt tail. <sighs> Sorry. Yawned.
You know, a fighting type move on Jotaro would be great. But no, it would make too much sense to give him a fucking decent stab move. Of course it fucking dodged! Should be the last one. Tried to use a light screen two turns in a row. Good job, stupid. Hello, Clownman. How's it going, buddy? Let's, do I have any physical moves that I can get rid of? Wish with? Not really keen on doubling up on... Dark. Oh yeah, Seed Bomb. All my good moves cannot be learned by my freaking conch shell. Eh, Dragon Rush. Let's go with that for now. Huh, can she learn Shadow Claw? She can. But that's got the exact same type coverage as Dark. What dig? No. Is this the one time logic would make sense? Hmm. Oh, cool, I proc the poison. Probably shouldn't rely on that. Especially given the fact that Crawdon has fucking light screen! Glad my target is the Pokemon League. Swift. Huh. Wow, Cronin has some shitty fucking special defense, doesn't it? Good thing I got Fire Pledge. Really wish I could rematch trainers. Because I would be all over that trainer that has the fucking chancy of 
on the next floor. And of course it's gonna get five fucking hits! Why would it not? Oh, my last moo moo milk. It's a good thing I bought 50 fucking hyper potions, because I'm gonna need them. Won't need them in the league, but I'll certainly need them for the grind. Wants to learn stockpile. No thank you. I have iron defense. I'm actually kind of curious. Was Fire Pledge doing more damage, or did Surf do more damage? Well, 160 versus like 135, I want to say. 138. They're both special, so. Nope, Fire Pledge was doing marginally more damage. 160 versus 135. Neutral stab versus non stab, super effective. Good job, Crodont. You get a gold star. Okay, it's a sock. Which I do not want to fight with Conquest. Because <laughs> that's just suicide. Because it's got a special set. And shit like Night Days. Can't hit very hard, but I can f fuck my accuracy. If anything bad happens to Conquest, it's <laughs> to the grave. Because even though I still have one max revive, I've already used a revive on her. Oh, wow. That wasn't bad. I kinda wish Clister didn't have shit fucking HP. I think that's like base 50? I've got 
Dragon Rush just in case I get a crowd on. Which I'm gonna get a crown on because, you know, my luck's just that shitty. I swear, does fucking Skullopede have skill link? I'm gonna look that up. Because that is obnoxious. It has heat proof or rockhead. Rockhead is its hidden ability. There is no reason for it to be getting this many fucking five hits. Because that's a rare occurrence. Motherfucker. Two thousand experience, damn. Too bad it's only gonna fall off from there. Shame I haven't found any freaking Audinos in a respectable grinding place. Or Blissey. What? A shiny Cronaut! Fucking shiny Cronaut! Holy fuck! Yes, please! Yes, 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 yes. Breaking the rule. I'm gonna call her Sparkles. Motherfucking shiny Crawdon! I cannot believe that! That is the second shiny Pokemon I have found during my Randlocks. That is fucking amazing. <laughs> I love it. First was a